Charlie Whiting dead, how did F1 director die? Lewis Hamilton leads emotional tributes Lewis Hamilton and Jensen Button have paid tribute and with the world rocked on the eve of the new season. His death was confirmed in the early hours of this morning and high passing leaves a huge hole in the sport. Whiting joined the FI in 1988 and served as F1's race director since 1997. He had previously worked with Hesketh since 1977 and joined Brabham in 1980 where he worked alongside Bernie Ecclestone. How did Charlie Whiting die? Charlie Whiting passed away on Thursday 14 March from a pulmonary embolism. FIA President Jean Todd released a statement this morning. It is with immense sadness that I learned of Charlie's passing, Todd said. Charlie Whiting was a great race director, a central and inimitable figure in Formula One who embodied the ethics and spirit of this fantastic sport. Formula One has lost a faithful friend and a charismatic ambassador in Charlie. All my thoughts, those of the FI and entire motorsport community go out to his family, friends, and all Formula One lovers. Charlie Whiting tributes Jensen Button posted on Instagram, in utter shock to hear the news about Charlie's passing. He always had the driver's safety and concerns in hand and didn't worry about putting us in our place when we acted out of line. We've lost such a lovely kind human being today who will be sadly missed by many. My heart goes out to his family at this very difficult time. Ribshaw Early. Lewis Hamilton said, I've known Charlie since I started in 2007. I was incredibly shocked this morning to hear the sad news and my thoughts and prayers are with his family. What he did for this sport, his commitment, he's such an iconic figure within the sporting world and he contributed so much to us. May he rest in peace. Sebastian Vettel said, I was as shocked as we all are when I heard the news this morning. Especially as I spoke to him yesterday and walked the track for the first couple of corners together with him. It's difficult to grasp when somebody's just not there anymore. I've known him for a long time and he's sort of been the driver's man. Obviously there are the regulations, then there's us, and he was the middle man, he was someone you could ask anything at any time. He was open to anyone, and any time his door was always open. He was a racer, just a very nice guy. Obviously all our thoughts, the whole paddock, the whole circus, the whole family of F1, are with him and his family in these difficult circumstances. Toto Wolf said, I was shocked and saddened to hear the news of Charlie's passing this morning. He was a pillar of our Formula One family, balanced in his approach, subtle in his understanding and always with the interests of Formula One as his main focus. He was a fantastic ambassador for our sport and a true guardian of its best interests. All of us who were lucky enough to know him will miss his ready smile and gentle humor. On behalf of the entire Mercedes Motorsport family, I send our deepest sympathies to his family and friends. Next news Charlie Whiting dead, Sebastian Vettel and Max Verstappen pay tribute to F1 chief. Whiting suffered a pulmonary embolism on Wednesday night and was confirmed as having passed away in the early hours of Thursday morning. The F1 season begins this Sunday with the Australian Grand Prix, and Whiting had been seen in the paddock on Wednesday just hours before he passed away. Speaking at a subdued press conference in Melbourne, Vettel joined Max Verstappen, Lewis Hamilton and Daniel Ricciardo in paying tributes to the legend of the sport. The Ferrari driver told reporters of the last time he saw Whiting, having walked the track with him on Wednesday ahead of the first practice session on Friday. I guess I was as shocked as we all are still now when I heard the news this morning, he said. Especially as I spoke to him yesterday, 
I walk the track for the first couple of corners together with him. It's difficult to grasp when somebody is just not there anymore. I think to add on what Lewis said, I've known him for a long time and he's always been our man, the driver's man there are all these regulations and he was sort of the middle man, he was someone you could ask anything to at any time, he was open to anyone and his door was always open. He was a racer, just a very nice guy. I'm shocked, I don't think I have much to add but I think our thoughts from the paddock, from you all of sports and all of Formula 1 are with him and his family in these difficult circumstances. Red Bulls Verstappen, back to have a strong season this year, recalled spending the day with Whiting last month in preparation for the season. Like everybody said it was a huge shock, he said. I spent the day with him in Geneva just a few weeks ago and had a chat about a lot of things. When I left at the time I said see you in Australia for another season of racing and when you hear that it's unbelievable. Just 66 years old, we have to just appreciate every morning and enjoy life. It's not just about Formula 1 but it is about enjoying life, this is just part of it. I think at the moment the most important thing is that our thoughts and prayers are with his family and his loved ones. Next news Charlie Whiting dead, FIA director's immense impact held as F1 tributes poor and dot Whiting passed away on Thursday morning, Australia time, after suffering a pulmonary embolism. Just days before the 2019 F1 season gets underway with the Australian Grand Prix, the racing world was stunned by the news, and drivers and pundits have spoken about the life of the former race director. Lewis Hamilton posted an image of him next to Whiting on his Instagram page accompanied with a touching message. I've just this minute heard of Charlie Whiting's death this morning and I am shook, he wrote. Can't believe it naturally and ultimately deeply saddened. Charlie did so much for this sport and helping push on so many areas for the drivers and their safety. My condolences to his family, I really enjoyed our talks over the years Charlie, you will be missed by us all. God rest your soul buddy. Hamilton's teammate at Mercedes, Valtteri Bottas, took to Twitter to broadcast his shock and pay tribute to Whiting. Very sad and surreal news ahead the Australian GP. Can't believe it. He posted. My thoughts are with the family and friends. He's done so much for the sport we love. Rest in peace Charlie. Croft referred to Whiting as having had an immense impact on the sport. Awful news here in Melbourne on the eve of the new season that Fire Ice director Charlie Whiting has passed away, he wrote. Admired and respected by everybody, his contribution to the sport was unparalleled and immense. We'll hugely miss him. R.I.P. Charlie. Toto Wolff, Mercedes team principal, said, I was shocked and saddened to hear the news of Charlie's passing this morning. He was a pillar of our Formula One family, balanced in his approach, subtle in his understanding and always with the interests of Formula One as his main focus. Charlie was a fantastic ambassador for our sport and a true guardian of its best interests, all of us who were lucky enough to know him will miss his ready smile and gentle humor. On behalf of the entire Mercedes Motorsport family, I send our deepest sympathies to Charlie's family and friends. Next news Charlie Whiting dies, aged 66. Longtime serving Formula One race director Charlie Whiting has died, on the eve of the start of the 2019 F1 season. The FIA confirmed that Whiting suffered a pulmonary embolism while in Melbourne, which hosts the opening round of the season. Whiting has acted as F1's race director since 1997, having joined the FIA in 1988. Prior to his role within the governing organization, Whiting worked at the Brabham and Hesketh Formula One teams.
It is with immense sadness that I learned of Charlie's sudden passing, said FIA President Jean Todd. I have known Charlie Whiting for many years and he has been a great race director, a central and inimitable figure in Formula One who embodied the ethics and spirit of this fantastic sport. Formula One has lost a faithful friend and a charismatic ambassador in Charlie. All my thoughts, those of the FI and entire motorsport community go out to his family, friends, and all Formula One lovers. F1's managing director Ross Braun added, I have known Charlie for all of my racing life. We worked as mechanics together, became friends and spent so much time together at race tracks across the world. I was filled with immense sadness when I heard the tragic news. It is a great loss not only for me personally but also the entire Formula One family, the Fion Motorsport as a whole. All our thoughts go out to his family. Thank you for watching the video. Be sure to share and subscribe to your channel to get the latest sports news around the world. Wished health and success. Goodbye.